Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming with another episode of Fable 3. Alright, and we left off. We had just completed the creepiest quest available, and, uh, yeah, there's no way that can't turn around and bite us. No, not at all. No. Anyway, uh, there was another quest over here, but... There was a quest that I wanted to go to down this way, ish. That was a bit of a, hmm, maybe not this way. Uh, maybe I'm in the wrong direction. No, I'm not. I'm, I'm in the right direction. I'm just turning my own self around because, uh, quite frankly, it's been a while, so I don't remember my way around the town that well. So, let's just continue on this way. He always thought you'd make a good what? It sounded like he said bard, didn't he? That's a great hey, chicken! Oh, well, thank you. Alright, so. Um, maybe not this way. Oh, this is a house. Yeah, wrong way. Okay, Doggo has found a dig spot, though, so. Follow him for a bit. Hey, money! God love money. All right. Do this real quick. And what do we got? More gold. Yay. All right. Now. I think. I think I have to go this way. Yes. Yes. Now I'm remembering goes to this big old empty field and this little thing here ah uh, <laughs> it's a trip down memory lane because the title of the quest is chicken chaser <laughs> uh, this is an old nickname you could get in all of the old games so let's go with it why not oh, this is terrible Somehow is it the gate got open and all of my chickens have escaped Somehow. I don't know how they did it, those chickens. And maybe I never will. Chickens are extraordinarily clever. Will you find okay. the brothers for me? Sure. Why not find the little shits? Right. You'll need this. Contrary to what most people think, chickens are very, very crafty. They won't fall um. for any of that. Come here, chicky, chicky. I've got some lovely treats for you. Oh, no. Too smart. You have to defeat them psychologically. Now, they won't remain one concentrated force. They'll have redeployed into groups of three or so to maximize their tactical advantage. When you find one tactical of these squads, advantage? flap your wings and such, and they should follow you back here. But don't let them try to negotiate with you. Negotiate? You do not want those little buggers inside your head, believe me. You're a man who's just been doing this job for far too long, clearly. You sure you're up for this? Many a valiant man's been destroyed trying to outwit chickens. Right. I have no doubt that the people of Brightwall will end up following you. Merely show them what you are capable of, and they cannot fail to become your supporters. <laughs> well, I'm going to show them what... I'm capable of, all right, after this particular quest. You've a new That's suit sure. in your wardrobe, a new feathery suit. Right. Aha. Uh -huh. All items. for the love of the game. <laughs> You're dressed as a chicken. What are you what are you what are you planning to do dressed as a chicken? <laughs> you know what, John, please? I'm starting to ask myself the same question. 
<sighs> can I at least die? Okay, I can die everything black. Okay. I'm fine with that. Yeah, there we go. Darkest possible. <laughs> oh. Joy. <laughs> that is splendid. Yeah, sure. <laughs> it's splendid, all right. The Sanctuary Shop has some new bits and bobs, I believe. Why not have a look? Um... I don't think I want to. In fact, I think I'm gonna... Oh! Well, at least the doggo will lead me to the quest items. Or quest chickens. Redeployed into groups of three. Boy. Lure the chickens. I'm sorry, am I? I have to make sure I'm hearing that right. Were they clucking in tune to a song? Well done. Their reign of terror is over before it began. All right, see if you can find some more. Sure. All righty. As long as they're not doing the robot chicken theme, I think I'll be okay. But I am on the edge of losing my shit. Just for future reference. In case people are curious, my particular thoughts on this quest. I am this close to losing it. <laughs> Okay. Let us continue on to wherever the next group of chickens is. Well, it sounds like they're this way. And the doggo barking is confirming. Alrighty. Um. Well, I must have went too far away. Over that way? In this direction, okay. Ah! <laughs> Even he's losing his shit. <laughs> Alright, let's go dig the dig spot. <laughs> Just give us a change of pace, if anything. <laughs> Bark, bark, bark. <laughs> Women's mercenary shorts. Okay, well, at least we have them now. Uh, okay, well, that actually brings up an interesting point. Uh, now that I found those, um, would there have been a different person to disguise myself as? I mean, it would make sense if there was, but who would that different person Don't be? Don't waste food ever again. And how Her would amazing mustaches? Mm, nice to how see how would so the mercenaries pick out the fact that I wasn't that person if I decided to play the princess and not the prince? That's a good question. That's lovely. Just keep doing what you're doing. And no matter what, don't show them any fear. Sure. If anything, I'm going to be showing them my laugh, because this is fucking ridiculous. Okay. Alrighty. Mm. If I start doing the robot chicken theme on my own... Because I have lost it. Why? Why are you growling about you, doofy doggo? What? Is a quest over this way? Add some character to your face with my famous beards. 
I might go um, over there after this. Um, hi. Hi. A, I'm a chicken. What do you think about that? Okay. <laughs> of course, it's right in the middle of town, too. Please come back. No finer goods in all of Brightwall. <sighs> You're sure to find something special for that someone special. Yeah. Sure. Okay. Like I could find that someone special after this particular quest. Okay. Alrighty. That's all of them. At last, the town can rest easy. Sure. Oh, Bernard, you've got to lock them up again. This isn't right. They deserve to be free. You're I'm sorry, on what? About the chickens and their freedom. You know what I think? I think it was you let them out. You're right. I admit it. I couldn't live with myself any longer being complicit in this chicken oppression. But they might have destroyed the entire town. Possibly the world. They might have gone off to live peacefully on possibly their own. They might have world. created great works of art or literature. I we don't think know. You're over we have no selling right to take away their fundamental liberties based on our own prejudices. And well, you're taking it too far. Taking away their liberties isn't enough. I have to assume you'll try to facilitate another escape. And that means the only choice is to kill them all. Oh, no, Bernard! No, don't! All right. Keep them locked up. At least so we can talk about this. You. You infiltrated the chickens. You lived among them. You know them better than anyone. What's to be done? It's a simple matter of kill or be killed. No, Bernard. They're not like that. Um. Mm. <laughs> I... <laughs> I don't know why they're asking me. <laughs> Because this seems like they're overselling their own viewpoints significantly in regards to chickens. They are fucking chickens. <laughs> Quite frankly, as long as they aren't penned up next to each other like those fucking chicken factories that we have nowadays... They're probably okay. And quite frankly, this isn't that bad. But I don't see the need to treat them as criminals that will fucking drop nukes all over the fucking countryside. B what? B what? Uh, but of course, that's just my personal takeaway. Um, we're going to be doing the asshole choice in any of these. But I had to personally say, what the fuck are they going on about? These are motherfucking chickens. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Let's just go with right. it. It's like I've said all along, we have to kill them all. You bastard! You murderer! Look, yeah. you're either with me, or you're one of them. Which is it? Um, what? Why are you using a gun? <laughs> Bernard's chick- Bernard's, rather, chickens are no longer a threat to anyone. 
You, however, are a menace to all that is decent or rational. <laughs> okay, I'll take that. I'll take that description. I kind of earned it. <laughs> all right. This is Chicken all Chicken trophy. I don't know if I can go on living with you, Bernard. No, no, let's not get hysterical. I think it's time for us to split up. I can't live with a man who holds innocent life in such low regard. Innocent life is what I was trying to protect. Is it worth taking one life to save another? It's worth taking 26 or however many other buggers we had. If I had to do it all over again, I'd do exactly the same. He didn't even count how many they Welcome had. Welcome to the sanctuary. Come on! At the very least, know that much. <laughs> oh my lord! Oh my lanta! Oh, Arkvoodle, save me now! Oh boy. Whoo. The armory is at your disposal. <laughs> I meant to hit the You've other one. There a new we go. pair of trousers. Very, very short trousers. Well, they aren't uh they aren't ones I'll be wearing, but Oh yeah, look at that. That would be a nice fit. That would look real good. Just not on me. <laughs> I mean, I guess I could wear them. Just be on the odd side. I always thought that one was quite exceptional. Yeah, that's why I saved it. And I took the time to save it when I made it a little bit ago. <laughs> I adjusted the outfit just a slight bit. I took the... Uh, mercenary shoes and uh, the military gloves back after the initial uh, outfit didn't get saved properly. So I'm hoping this one will save uh, you know, actually the way it's supposed to be and uh, it'll keep this look for a while. Anywho. Any other business to attend to? Not that I can think of. Wow! I am slowly uh, encroaching on Popeye's <laughs> time played. Oh boy. That's going to take a lot of time. Alright. Another quest. Okay. Lambert and Pinch need help putting on their play in Brightwall. That sounds simple enough after the shenanigans that I just went through. <laughs> uh, here's hoping uh, that's the case. And it isn't going to be a weird twist <laughs> near the uh, near the middle of the quest instead of like the beginning of the quest like the last two I've done. Just immediate Crazy twist out of nowhere. Okay. Sell me your unwanted items. Oh, I want I to am. buy them. Believe me, I am. Fifty percent for a pearl. I just hell yeah, I don't need to that. Buy your unwanted items. Hell yeah, I don't need this. Thank you for your custom. I hope I can make a profit on that. Last time I only I have one seen, emerald. Right wall was buzzing with culture. I remember an acting troupe who attracted huge crowds. What was their name? Come back if you have anything else to say. What was their name? I think he's mentioning the uh, other quest there. I'm assuming. I'm hoping. That's what he's mentioning. Want some healthy drinks? Um, considering I'm not going to wear it, I might as well sell it. <laughs> I, uh, I didn't realize <laughs> that the mannequin would, uh, 
change to proper woman's one if I was selling it here. That's a pose. I was here, Bright Wall was buzzing with culture. I remember an acting troupe who attracted huge crowds. Yeah. What was their name? I buy stuff. I think I'm gonna have to keep a couple of these. Not the mercenary beard. I can sell that off comfortably. Tattoos. I'll keep these. Maybe. Uh. Yeah, I'm not gonna keep the mercenary tattoos. Thank set, you for your custom. Some of the rest of them I might keep. Um. Saker portrait, huh? Last time I was here, Bright Wall was buzzing with culture. It, Walter's just gonna keep going on and on about that, isn't it? <laughs> All right. Um. I'm kind of curious that if I hold on to this, maybe I can get a better price for it. So I'm just going to save it for now. Any, nope, nothing else. All right. Okay. Well, I did that. Um, Got a question or maybe you're just browsing? Bit of a shortage on well, goods. Gonna, so want I'm some to have a hey. Last time I was here, drinking alcohol right might give you a small amount of health, but beware the I after effects. An troupe who attracted huge huh. crowds. Spirits. Uh, what was their name? Hmm. Where is? And this one is food. Eating this will give you a reasonable amount of health, though it will make you put on weight. Hello there. I've Wait, got the best stuff you've ever seen. That? At the best prices, too. Okay, it said the description. Okay, cool. Um, Pleased to serve you. Come back anytime. I might just buy a lot of these. Hope you enjoy it. Let me Come buy back your anytime. Items. Cool. Fair price paid. Last time I was here, right Walter, was could you quit banging on about the damn acting, acting troop come on all right uh let's get a couple of these health potions too just to have them in the back pocket this one maybe not so much don't need that as much the slim quick Line of weapons have achieved notoriety for the counterintuitive the way it allows users to lose weight by putting it on. You're making a great saving on that. Best shot uh, right wall. You'd be mad to go anywhere else. Make yourself fatter. Spend eight thousand of your personal gold. Kill a hundred and fifty ugly creatures. <laughs> Um, what is the determining factor for ugly is the question I want to ask. That is also a fucking weird thing. <laughs> a set of weapons commissioned by Logan to exterminate every last troll from Albion. As anyone traveling throughout the kingdom can testify, the campaign was entirely ah, successful. That item is discounted. Yeah, all of them are discounted from the look of it. Alright. Giant Bane has killed 10 large enemies with flourishes. 80% damage versus large enemies. That is pretty good. Kill 150 enemies with an unweaved fireball spell. Unweaved. That's a particular terminology that we haven't gotten to yet. That is uh, the terminology for when you can equip two gauntlets for spells at once, uh, you can weave one spell into another and have it do double effects. Unweaved just means straight out that spell. And regeneration. Earn guild seals from evil expressions. Gain health with each hit. Hmm. Well, considering it's Logan, that makes sense. All right, so let's check out the Barnum of the Cater. Barnums! Oh no! 
Barnum, one of Albion's great entrepreneurs, bought the rights to this weapon hoping to make a fortune. Sadly, he died before he could witness its success. Yeah, because of Reaver, that fucking asshole. Oh, man. Else. The hard worker. Plus one gold per hit. What? <laughs> plus 12 extra damage. Become friends with 30 villagers. And give gifts to 20. Oh, that one's going to be impossible to do. There's almost no one playing this online. Oh, there's no... No, jeez. Old Malice. Some say this weapon emanates evil. Evil, rather. Some prefer the term exudes. You're making a great saving on that, that is actually a hell of a look. Uh, hooligan. Feather-brained. And explosive. Oh! Adds a shotgun spray, huh? So it turns it from a rifle to then a shotgun. Hmm. I guess things are alright, but they could be a lot better. That's probably true. Alright, well, I just wanted to double check how the weapons... Oh, fucking stop banging on about it, Walter. I'll go. Jesus, Harold Christ. <laughs> Alright, Jesus. Alright, let's head up over this way, because I think that's the direction I need to go. There we go. And these are the jobs over here. I think this one is Loot Hero. Yep. There we go. You should keep checking my shop. You never know when I might have Just do it. Just to build up the money. So. And, uh, the money is bugged. That's great. You gotta make sure you're quick. Otherwise, the entire thing will just blow right past you. Good one. <laughs> uh, the fact that he's doing poses after. Truly splendiferous. Oh, price is a quite good well, I'm, I'm managing to do pretty well on this because usually I start fucking up around this point. This is I'm doing great, kind of good. I'm I'm waiting for the uh, game to screw it up for me though. Because it decides to hitch on something or whatever. I'm just waiting for that moment. Oh, I buggered that. I screwed that up. That was right near the end. Hit the wrong button. <laughs> good with your hands and pies. Well, okay. That's a, that's a description. I just wanted to build up a little bit of money there, but the, uh, as you saw, the indicator for gold kind of buggered up a little bit. I have no doubt that the people of Brightwall will end up following you. Merely yeah, show probably. them what you are capable of, and they cannot fail to become your supporters. Here's hoping. But uh, for right now, I'm going to see if I can buy any of the houses here. I already bought one. Bought one of these a while ago. Oh, jeez. The house condition goes down really quickly. Did I ever set the rent higher? I did not. Let's fix that now, shall we? Alrighty. Where was that one place? One place I intended on buying. Miss No Mer House. Okay, great. Thank you. Thank you. And I can't buy this yet because I don't have Whatever the did happen pack. with that Morley play? Is it still missing? Uh, probably. Not for sale now. 
Oh man. Eventually, I guess. Well, let's add a couple more to the uh, amount of houses we own. You know what? Let's add a. Let's add another one. We have enough money. Let's add another one. Start exponentially increasing my money, eh? Sounds good to me. And I shall go around and repair the rest of them in just a moment. But for now, i got to end the episode. Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one and only Stray Cat playing games. And, uh... Ending up being part of the destruction of a bunch of chickens that a farmer owns because the farmer's crazy and so is his wife to let them run around freely through the town. And uh, they're both crazy because they're chickens. Not, you know, anything worse than that. And uh, then we fucked around with uh, items and jobs and shit. For you.